So you might be in a situation where for some reason you're getting this, your connection is not private, or your the website you're going to is not secure on Google Chrome. Now, this is a very, very common issue, and it happens basically to a lot of different people. But the very first thing I would recommend you to kind of keep your eye out for is to understand that this is here to protect you. This specific pop-up is to basically for you to see that the website you're going to may not be a safe website. So if you are 1,000, 1 billion percent sure that the website you're going to is secure and everything like that, there is going to be a little panel at the very bottom of one of these types of pages, which will allow you to click on advanced. And on that advanced panel, it'll allow you to go and go into that website. But it's not going to go ahead and allow you to do it unless you click on the advanced or the other option, which is basically to access the website that is secure. Now, the reason why this is coming up most of the time, as far as I understand, is because sometimes this may not be a safe website. It may be on a blacklist somewhere for these types of websites, or also sometimes your internet connection may not even be secure itself. So if you're accessing like public Wi-Fi or something like that, sometimes you may get these prompts even on safe websites. On top of that, if you're using a VPN of some sort and you're accessing a website that's not supposed to be through that VPN, that can also cause some issues too. But usually, if it is a safe website that you're familiar with, you should be able to click on advance or reload the website, and you should be able to access it that way. Now, if it's still not working and you're trying to do that, the other thing you may want to try doing is to update your specific Google Chrome application. So what you can do is you can make your way over to your app store, whether you're on Google Chrome here or whether you're on, you know, on your PC or your Mac. You want to go ahead and make your way over to wherever you downloaded Google Chrome from, and you want to go ahead and update it. If you're on your PC, you can update it within the application. Go ahead and click on update, and that may end up fixing the prompt for you too. Sometimes, most of the time, it's not probably going to fix it, but it's still an option that you have, and I'd probably recommend checking it out too. So those are pretty much the main ways to go and do it for the most part. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. The like button helped me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.